my style to be jacketed. She know my swag is immaculate. I don't play pong, I drink activists. Lambo to go, yeah, that's accurate. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, No Mercy Lambo, and today I'm bringing y'all my offense. It's the bunch tight end offense. It's the best offense in the game. And it's got the best play in the game if you watch my top 10 passing plays, PA all cross. Now, why do I run the run heavy playbook? Well, the reason I'm in the run heavy playbook is because it's the only bunch tight end in the game that's got tight end corner and curl flat corner. And I need both those plays for the ski. The way you want to have your audibles, you want X spot, inside switch, curl flat corner, and PA cross. All you need is a really good receiver in your slot. Everything else doesn't really matter. If they're running dollar or something where they have all DBs on the field, put your running back in and you can weak box them and run all over them. You feel me? And audible down to a better run formation. Now, the first play I'm going to be showing y'all is the curl flat corner. Now, if you didn't know, the most overpowered routes in this game are smart routed fucking corners. That's why everyone's running Z spot out of bunch and shit like that. You feel me? Now, peep game. You're going to smart route Y. Put B on a streak. You're going to put A on a uh, delay fade. RB on a wheel. And then X on an out route. What you're going to do, you're going to audible this out. Boom. Hey! Best formation in the game, man. I'm about to show y'all heat. Now, if you watch my top 10 passing plays, this looks very similar to Z Spot, which is what all the pros are running out of Gun Bunch. Only difference is Gun Bunch tight end. Motion it out. Oh my goodness. They did it again. It's not much you can do to stop this offense, bro, because everyone's going to be worried about this play right here with the delay fade. But now that you have a flood concept to the left side, too, they can't really do that anymore. They cannot really do that anymore. Boom. <laughs> and that play right there, that is cheesy as fuck, man. They got to have some zone drops out there. That is going to torch them every time. Another way I like to run this, especially in the red zone, you put B on a streak. You're going to put A on an in, RB on a wheel. This X receiver is on a streak. Now, in the red zone, this is going to be an easy dot right in the middle of the field. Peep game. Peep game. You want to hike it right about here. And Rico Gafford should be open right in the middle of the field, just like that. In the red zone, that's going to be an easy touchdown, bro, when they least expect it right in the middle. What you're going to do is you're going to set it up to where, same thing, but you're going to motion this wide receiver to the right. And what should happen is this wide receiver should get open all the way across the field. You feel me? Boom. Hey. Boy, I be torching, nigga. Now, the next play I like to run in this formation is called X spot. It's a everything beater. What you're going to do is you're going to put B on a slant, RB, to the, RB on an out, Y on a flat, X on a hitch. If I ever need any short yards, I'm coming to this play most likely. What you're going to do is hike it. Something's always open. X is wide open. You feel me? Take that. Like, I've waited way too long trying to show y'all a deeper play. But that's going to be open so much for like 5 to 10 yards. Bro, it's insane. Once again, I'm going to show y'all it. This is a staple. Like, this is a top 5 play uh, out of this fucking formation, bro. Look, boom. X isn't open this time. It's all good. RB's open. If they're coming out in something like match coverage, that B slant, rec that B receiver is going to get wide open on that slant, bro. No size. Right here, match. Perfect. All right, look. Against match, this um, this B receiver is going to get wide open. Boom. Hey, set up number three. All right. You're going to put A on a flat, RB on a wheel, X on a hitch, right? Similar setup, but now you motioning this dude to the right. Boom. A. X is probably open. Yup. And Y is open. Just so y'all know, this is a combination of like three bunch tight end ebooks I've bought. You feel me? Now, the last way I like to attack man out of this, just put B on a slant and motion him out. That's simple. Motion slants are glitchy. All right, the next play in this scheme is called PA boot over, a.k.a. PA all cross. Very simple, man. A on a delay fade. Smart route X. I'm pretty sure everybody knows this setup, but if you don't, this is the best play in the game. 
boom. You want to get outside, that's the point of uh, having the escape artist. Because if you have the escape artist, then you're capable of getting that delay fade wide open. The second way I like to set it up, other than the bass setup, put X on a curl, B on an out, or B on a flat, you feel me? And on third and long, their users are probably going to chase the uh, crosser, and you're going to have X wide open. Another way I like to set this up, what you're going to do, you're going to put A on a streak, and you're going to put one of these receivers on a slant. It don't matter who. I'm going to just put B on a slant. Motion them over. Boom. A. Somebody's bound to get open. Next, we got inside switch. Now, the way I like to run inside switch, right, I put A on a smart route, Y on a slant, and I motion Y to the right. And this looks just like the curl flat play out of uh, Trips Tight End. Boom. Another way I like to set this play up is I like to make it look like the curl flat out of Trips Tight End. Again, you're going to put a smart route A, B on a drag. Boom. Peep game. This is a one play touchdown at an inside switch. My favorite cover three beater in the game. I like to set it up like this. And what you're going to do is be on the short side. And when they're in cover three, I'm going to show you. Cover three. And you're going to motion this X receiver out. And the B receiver is going to get wide open. Oh my goodness. You've seen it, man. You've seen, you seen it. I'm going to run it one more time for y'all. Show y'all the consistency. I'm going to actually block the extra head just to not get sacked. I'm going to go ahead and block RB. And it's still going to work. All right. I'm going to put him on a streak. Get out of there. If it's up, then it's stuck, man. I think Kyler Murray sucks. But you see the one play touchdown, man. Run that if you're trying to be covered through. All right. This next play right here is called tight end corner. Very important play. Now, look. If they come out in something like the cover four drop show two meta, very simple. All you do is smart route Y and put A on a streak. And what's going to happen is you're going to get a one play touchdown to the left side. That is opener than I've ever seen anything in my life, bro. They cannot run cover four drop show two against this formation, bro. Another way you can uh, torch uh, the cover four drop show two that I forgot to show y'all is you can come out in that PA all cross play and just put X on the streak. And that's going to torch it. For some reason, it just it just makes them drop, man. I don't know. I do not know why, but it, it, it torches it. Bad game mechanics. That's all I can say. Now, another way you can set this up is just like the uh, trips tight end curl flat. Or if you want, you could set it up like this. I like to do this sometimes when... Because they're used to me um, using Y as the crosser. So I'll set it up like this. Make sure uh, B is my crosser instead. I'll show you what I mean. So yeah, bro. You can put B on a streak. You feel me? Like, it's so much you can do with this formation, bro. It's ridiculous. And that's it, man. That's it. It was like it's nothing, man. Oh shit! Yeah. Woo! But yeah, man, that's the uh, bunch tight end scheme. I hope y'all love this video, man. This is what I run. I showed y'all literally all my plays that I run. I don't run any passing plays other than what's in this video right here. So, hope you can put this together and get yourself to be comp, man, for real. Get up with the Madden pros. Hope you enjoyed this video once again. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and peace. But I just brought it back, put in some work, now my diamonds do jumping jacks Jump on the stage, make a dime, have a heart attack 21 young, done my thumb through a hundred racks I am not cuffing, no party, no cardiac